Hey guys, welcome to today's edition of Lottie's NHL Locks. Sorry I didn't post my picks yesterday. As I told you guys, I don't always have the time to post the picks on YouTube, but I always post them on my Instagram page, sports.betting.system. So I hope you're following because the one NHL pick I posted yesterday, the Toronto Maple Leafs, and the two NBA picks, the Los Angeles Clippers and the San Antonio Spurs, uh, both went through yesterday. So if you're not following me on Instagram, you should sports.betting.system. I post my picks. I will always post my picks on Instagram. I won't necessarily post them on here. In this case, just had one for hockey and two for NBA. So I didn't see the point in making a video for just three picks. So if you do like my picks and you do bet on them or you just like knowing what they are, Follow me on Instagram at sports.betting.system. Let's get to today's NHL picks. First, we're going to go with the Columbus Blue Jackets on the road in New Jersey. So the Blue Jackets are fighting for a playoff spot, losers of three of four. They find themselves just outside the Eastern Conference playoffs, although they do have a game in hand. The Devils are solid at home, 17 and 17. The Jackets are better on the road at 19 and 11. They're actually a lot better on the road than they are at home. Corey Schneider is expected to start in goal for New Jersey tonight. I'm guessing they're trying to protect the confidence of their rookie goaltender, Mackenzie Blackwood, who appears to be the future, at least in goal for the New Jersey Devils. He stopped 62 of the last 65 shots he's faced. Uh, that's in, over uh, the span of two games. They're 6-6 six and six in the games he's played. This is a team that's 16 games under 500, yet 512 games with him in goal. Just 2.25 goals per game, saving 93% of the shots he's faced compared to Schneider's 3.38 goals per game and 89% save percentage. So keep an eye out. Make sure Blackwood isn't starting. I wouldn't bet against the Devils if he is. I've read from two sources, one of them being ESPN, that have said Schneider is starting. But keep an eye out. Things do change. If it is Schneider in goal for the Devils, lock number one is the Columbus Blue Jackets. Lock number two, we're going to go with the Islanders. Despite the awful treatment of my guy, John Tavares, the other day, that was disgusting. That was despicable. If you're following me on Instagram, you saw my post classless. This guy gave you 10 years of his career and left to play for the team he grew up cheering for. All those fans were showing so much passion for the Islanders, which sort of implies that if they got the chance to sign with any team in the NHL, they would probably sign with the New York Islanders, the team they cheer for. Back to the pick. This one's easy. Isles have lost three of four on their home ice where they're 19 and 14. They're due for a win at home. Their opponent The Ottawa Senators are 9-24 and on the road. They traded away the only good player they have, or they had, I should say. They're fresh off a road win. This isn't a team that's going to win two in a row on the road, maybe at all the rest of the season. They definitely won't tonight in New York, or Brooklyn, I should say. Lock number two is the Islanders over the Senators. Lock number three, we're going to go with the Penguins over the Panthers. The Panthers had a nice stretch a few weeks ago where they won five of six. All of those games except one were at home. They lost a couple on the road and then continued the losing even when they came home. Losers of four straight now. We took the Penguins over the Canadiens the other day because we thought Pittsburgh would be in playoff mode. Well, they're still in playoff mode because a loss and a Columbus win would put them in a three-way tie for eighth in the East. The Pens are experienced enough to know they need some breathing room, some room for error. They can't afford to lose a home game to the Florida Panthers. The Pens are 17 and 14 at home. They've lost two straight and three of their last four at home. Let's bet on them going. Let's bet on them going two and three over the last five at home before going one and four over the last five at home. Lock number three, Pens over Panthers. And the final lock today, Tampa Bay. What's going on here? Oh, let's scroll back. Tampa Bay over what the hell? Tampa Bay, okay, we'll just do it like this. Tampa Bay over the Winnipeg Jets. Winnipeg aren't great on the road relative to where they are in the standings, just 17 and 14 on the road. The Lightning have the league's best home record at 27 and 7. They've lost recently enough, so they're not due for a loss. Plus, the Jets beat them in their first meeting, so the Lightning do have motivation to come out and win this game. Lock number four and final lock of the day Tampa Bay Lightning 
over the Winnipeg Jets. I will be posting NBA picks a little bit later. Good luck to you if you're placing any bets today. If you're not following me on Instagram, go do that, sports.betting.system, and have a great day. Major key alert. I got the keys, keys.